This is Desk Hog. And immediately you're asking yourself, what's a desk hog? What's going on here? I can tell you how this is an open source, internet connected, completely hackable little computer. But to really get into what's going on with desk hog, we gotta go back. Aren't you tired of computers having all the RAM you need? Your machine is too fast and it's probably too powerful. Sometimes all you need is a board that can barely do. Now, nah, wait, there's a better way to do this. I'm Danilo, I work at Post Hog, and I make things. Films, interfaces, stories, mistakes, it's a long list. And this is a story about making something. It's about making this. This whole desk hog story starts about four months ago, at my work table. See, I have this board. Wait, no, we gotta go back further than that. This whole story starts about two years ago. So I got these heat pumps from my house and I love them. The drawback was I had these terrible controllers. It's just rubber button crap. And this bothered me for a while, but I realized I could build my way out of this problem. So I got a microcontroller board. I connected it to a bunch of sensors. I wrote some code and I had a controller to put the heat pumps on the home automation system. Now, a year after that, my friend and colleague, Ben White, posts to Slack, hey, why don't we build a Tamagashi? And that's when I realized I've got a microcontroller board sitting in a drawer. And it is 80% of the way to a Tamagotchi. It's got three buttons. It's got a beautiful screen. It's got a battery connector. This thing wants to be a palm-sized toy. So I got to work. In my spare time, or a couple nights, I put together a prototype. Now it wasn't quite just like that because, well, physical reality is hard. But when it finally all clicked together, boy, that felt special. And at the end, we end up with this fully open source, palm-sized bundle of fun. One of the perks of living in the 21st century is that the distance between what we imagine and what we can create is as thin as a soap bubble. Microcontroller boards are cheap. 3D printing is fast. And the kind of stuff that used to take an entire team months and months to do, you could do in a Saturday. Desk Hog is a weird, wonderful introduction to the magic of building hardware. This is not gonna be the most powerful computer you ever buy, but it is for the curious, for the tinkerer, for the builder. We wanted to give you a mix of fun and useful, so we've got access to your post hog data right on this tiny screen. You wanna keep up with your numbers? Desk Hog's got you. We also want you to have a good time doing silly stuff, so you can build games for it. We've got a whole bunch of documentation to help you figure out how to do it. We have done all of the hard stuff for you. Wi-Fi, we got you covered. Battery life is 10 hours. We've got a beautiful little screen and all of the graphics code you need to start writing things to it. The rest is up to you. This is just the beginning for you to start building on. This is your canvas. This is your foundation. This is an invitation to start asking interesting questions like, what could I do if I had a pipe between the world of code and the world of atoms? What would you do with a tiny bubble of cyberspace that can really go anywhere? You do not need permission to do something cool. You do not need a plan. You need an idea and you need some time on Saturday.